everybody. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I'm Nicole. If you could please subscribe to my channel, turn your notification bell on, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a positive comment, I do appreciate it. As you may have seen from the title, today's video, I am going to be showing you what I received in a Pinch Me box. Um, for those of you that don't know what Pinch Me is, Pinch Me is something that you can sign up for online to receive products for free to review. Uh, I do suggest whenever you sign up that you do list as many products that you and your family use um, and stores around you and that type of thing because they go based off of your profile to what kind of samples they leave for you to select from to put into your little cart to check out, of course. Now, I do not pay shipping for these particular items. I've never cashed out my points to get other items with. Um, I'm not really sure if those require shipping or not, but these are just the free ones that I do. But it comes typically in this pink box or sometimes an orange box. And they have products in there, like I said, that you selected. Now, I do want to mention that these products take a while to arrive. They say allow up to four to six weeks for them to come. So don't be anticipating them to arrive right away because depending on where you're located and where their warehouse is located, it could take a while to get to you. Um, I've actually not been able to do any samples the past couple of months. This was actually the last time that I had selected samples for Pinch Me. I'm hoping I will be able to do more. I also do Influencer. Um, I'll leave some Pinch Me videos and Influencer videos down below if you're interested in checking out those products. Because, of course, both of those um, things you can sign up to try to get free products to review. Now, with Pinch Me, um, you just take a picture of your products and put the hashtags and that kind of thing on Instagram. There's not really a lot to it. I mean, you do kind of do answer a few things and that type of thing. Influencer, on the other hand, you have to... Uh, do certain things for the campaign and you have to get it done in time. I do want to mention for Influencer, sometimes they send you important emails after you do a product and they are required emails so you can continue to do that. But I won't be showing anything for Influencer. I have not received anything in a while. This is just strictly pinch me. But I do typically like to mention both of those for you because if you are a smaller channel like me, you don't receive PR. You purchase everything yourself out of pocket with your own money. You don't get things sent to you for free to review. Every now and again, maybe a brand might reach out to you and see if you want to do it, but they typically reach out to larger channels. So for me, this is a way for me to be able to get, I guess if you want to call it PR, to review products because it's basically a product review. But even if you don't have a channel, you can do this stuff yourself. That way you can have stuff to, you know, try out. I mean, it doesn't hurt. It saves you a lot of money versus having to buy the full size of the product and it may not work out for you. Now, the first thing I have here is this BioTrue Hydration Boost eye drops it says each drop provides instant moisture to dry irritated eyes using naturally inspired ingredients it says it's preservative free contact lens friendly ph balanced designed for screen users so typically people who are on their phone a lot do gaming watch a lot of tv that kind of thing this is probably a good product for you to test out especially if you do um to social media like YouTube or TikTok or anything like that. If you spend a lot of time on the screen, it might be something that you want to check into. But I always mention anytime I show something that is for your eyes, a supplement, anything like that, consult with your doctor first before you try it because you do not want it to have any type of reaction to anything. You just got to make sure it's okay because you never know some products you may or may not be able to use depending on if you have any underlying medical conditions or that type of thing. But it does say it's naturally inspired eye care and it does have this. It says it's available at Target and it has this little QR code. I will leave it up here for a second. That way, if you are interested, 
you can scan this code to find out more information about this but this is how it came in this little package it says that there are five single use drops in this so i will get a pretty good chance to figure out what i think of them now i have got um lumify before and it's just a one single use in that particular box and with the size of the box you would think that they would put a couple of more in there but that's okay i mean each brand is different but it says it's naturally inspired ingredients, like I said. And this one does say that it expires in December of this year, which I like that they put that on there as well. So I'll be testing this out and let you know what I think about it once I get around to trying it. Um, my allergies do act a little crazy sometimes, um, just depending on the reaction of what's going on outside and like, you know, that type of thing. Um, and then sometimes your eyes can get irritated from many different things. Like maybe you wear lashes and one day your eyes just don't agree with it. You know, it's that kind of thing that this is just great to have. And like I said, screen time as well. Now this next thing I have is Head and Shoulders Supreme Supremely Satisfying Sulfate Free Scalp Care. Um, this is... It says now sulfate free shampoo and conditioner free from sulfated surface and then it does have a coupon that i will be using once i test this product out because if my hair actually agrees with this product i will probably be getting more because my hair tends to be a little picky <laughs> i guess you could say if that makes sense some products work for me some do not um but this is the head and shoulders uh dandruff scalp and hair shampoo supreme nourish and smooth with aragon oil and jehovah oil free from sulfates parabens dyes sulfates and this is actually a really good size sample this is 3.0 fluid ounces or 90 milliliters which is a really good size compared to most samples i have received in the past from companies and I do want to mention that this says it expires September of 2023. I don't know if you can see that or not, but I do love whenever companies put that on there. And it also has the little QR code. I'm not sure if it is picking up on it or not, but there is a QR code on this that you can scan to find out more information on. And then the other one we have is also Head & Shoulders, Supreme Nourish & Smooth with Aragon Oil and Jehovah, free from sulfates, parabens, sulfate dyes, and this is 2.5 fluid ounces or 75 milliliters. And this is the hair conditioner, which is really great because I cannot use a lot of products that are like a two-in-one, three-in-one, that kind of thing. I do have to use a conditioner because my hair is super long, super thick, and so I just have to do a little bit more with mine hair care wise. And I'm very particular about my hair products as well. But there are the drug facts on the back. It says helps prevent reoccurrence of flaking and inching associated with dandruff. Um, there's warnings on here and that type of thing. So I'm really excited to give these a try. Like I said, they are a really great size, so I will be able to get more than one use out of them and let you know based off of that. I have received some head and shoulder stuff in the past that I received in little baby samples that I actually did like as well. So I'm hoping I will like these. But again, for this um, particular haul, I got the BioTrue Hydration Boost for Irritated Dry Eyes. This is five single uses. And it says it has the sterile applicators, of course. So that is really nice. And then I got the Head & Shoulder Supreme Nourish & Smooth Aragon Oil Jehovah Oil Shampoo, which is a three ounce bottle. And then the Head & Shoulder Supreme Nourish & Smooth uh, Conditioner, which is a 2.5 fluid ounce bottle. Let me know down below if you get Pinch Me let me know if you're interested in signing up. I will try to leave the link down below to take you directly to the website so you can sign up. Um, it's not like an affiliate link or anything like that. It's just a link to take you directly there so it's easier for you to find. Um, I want to say 
If you've tried either of these products, let me know how it worked out for you. I always love to know how things work out for you because they may work for you and may not work for me or vice versa. That's the beauty of it all. Everything works differently for every person. And that's just how it kind of goes, you know. You just got to base it off of reviews and that type of thing. But I want to say thank you all so much for watching. If you are new, I'm Nicole. If you could please subscribe to my channel, turn your notification bell on, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a positive comment. I do appreciate it. I did want to mention that this eye look was created with the Morphe Sweetest Tea palette. Um, I will leave that link down below so you can check that video out. Uh, always remember to have love in your heart. Put a smile on somebody's face and do something kind for somebody because you never know how much it may mean to them. As always, I love you all so very much, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.